This government wants to monetize talents to support livelihoods. It is not just about hosting events. It's not just about taking people to participate in activities. So you think you'll impress us by telling us, oh, there is an event happening in Dubai, we must go. Oh, there is some activity happening in Vancouver. Oh, there is some activity in San Diego. No. We want to see how are these activities, how are your objectives helping in the monetization of talents? Monetization of talents means you have a program where these talents are supporting livelihoods. Our work on Bob Nandeleka his events. What is your agenda of making sure that what they are participating in supports their livelihoods? Number three, we want commercialization value for national development. How is your display, your sporting activities, contributing to the commercialization agenda for national development? So you want to hold, to host the magical case. Well, that is uh, Cabinet Secretary for Sports, Babona Mwambu, who is currently meeting sports federations and at Nairobi, Upper Hill, where governance and compliance is top on the agenda. You also like threatening government, that you see government, you touch us, and some international federation will come for you. Let me tell you. That will not cut with us at all. If it takes your discipline being suspended so that you can follow the law, we will allow you to be suspended so that you can follow the law. We will take it from you. If it takes you to be banned for one to three years so that we can clean you up, we will allow you to be banned so that we can clean you up. Take it from me. Because at the end of the day, we will not compromise national interest because you are threatening us with a ban from some international federation. So just follow the law. And why, why is it so difficult to follow the law? Just follow the law. Accede to the Sports Act. Follow the Sports Act. Respect the Constitution of Kenya. And by the way, is of federation then you are international bodies fifa world aquatics all these federations i talk to them even me i talk to them don't think you're the only one who talks to them i also talk to them actually i talk to them more than you in fact i talk to them a hell of a lot by the way me will pick a story now son those things that you normally think will come to us to threaten us. We talk to them. And I have made it clear to many of them that sports in Kenya is big, sports in Kenya is important, and we have told them, help us for sports in Kenya to be run properly. We will never touch a federation that is following the law, is engaged in good governance, and is following what needs to be followed. We'll never bother you.